Yo, what's good? It's Mastermind MMA. And first off, before I get into this video, I gotta I gotta let you guys know something. I gotta let you know what's been going on. Motherfucking I didn't think I'd be having to deal with this bullshit. But I think that it's pretty obvious who's been doing something. And my a few someone's trying to been false flagging my videos. And guess what videos have been getting flagged? My fucking video, my podcast about MMA quick hits. My fucking every call I did with MMA from the heartland. My 214 recap with Jamari. Like, um, the, my, my fucking, my custom belt shirt video got like, so it's just like, we know those bitches from over that side are probably trying to do some shit, but. You know, it doesn't even matter because it's it's um it's all my original shit. So what the fuck are you flagging it for, bitch? Um, we know we know it's them and they're just trying to fuck with us, but it it doesn't matter, dude, because none of that shit works. I'm un we're unaffected by it. But I got some reports from someone saying some like some shit might be going on. I don't know if it's there and fucking up or not, but. If you see anything weird on the channel, let me know. If you see any any like fake accounts, any any response from my official account, the name will be highlighted in blue and verified over YouTube. That's how you tell if it's the uploader responding or not. So be on the lookout for that. Let me know if you guys see any weird shit immediately. Like anything that just seems off off about the channel or you see some weird shit that doesn't fit let me know hit me up about it because these bitches are trying some bullshit but any fucking way any motherfucking way back to the real shit back to the to the true mma community just talking about some real shit whoo johnny bones jones what the fuck man <clears throat> And before I dive into this, shout out to the homie Grand3K, who is the first person to to reach out about the t-shirt and cop a t-shirt, so s salute to him. Much motherfucking love, homie. I appreciate it. And that's the, the Money Belt shirt. Link will be in the description. I have new prints that I'll be dropping after this video. I got a bunch of new prints that I've been working on today. Uh, some dope shit and they're all gonna be up after this video so you'll see it so back into John Jones man what the fuck dude like alright it's either I don't like seeing things in black and white I never do and it's never the answer nothing is that simple of being as black and white but <laughs> In this situation, at this point, I could think it. there can only be two things. And this is, you guys know on the page, you guys know on the channel, I'm a giant John Jones fan. And it, it could be only two things, I think, at this point. One, he's actually doing steroids. Or two, he's being set up. Because I don't see how, how you know, it, it, it's just illogical any other way. Because when you look at it, I was waiting a few days to, or a day or so to hear more information. Not too much came out, but TMZ Sports reports were confirmed. It actually finds out that Malky, uh, John Jones' agent, found out via TMZ. So that's fucked up. They didn't even get notified personally till the public got notified. Um, he, he, uh, confirmed that it was that anabolic steroid and they're going to figure out how it got in his system. And the only way I feel like John Jones could be truly fully liberated if this is, a a huge landmark case where they find someone tampering with the sample and adulterating the sample. That's the only way I could see Johnny getting fully exonerated. Uh, a tainted supplement excuse at this point. If 
if you're coming saying you took something and you didn't know it didn't have it in there at this point after all this the legacy is tainted my man the legacy is tainted just as tainted as, as those supplements and fuck man when I first heard it I didn't want to believe it man I was like this is impossible because before the lead up to 214 like I was like fuck man I hope nothing happens with John to fuck it up and we don't get the fight and then we got the fight we thought it was good and then it got fucked up it's unreal and and I don't know so he passed all the random drug tests and the one drug test he knows he's gonna take that's what he popped for for a steroid that wouldn't even benefit him in that time period so something's off I don't know I'm not gonna make a full assumption until I fully know what happened at this point it's either he's he's a steroid user or someone's been setting him up I don't see it I I, I don't see a, a tainted supplement being legit unless it's that big of and I I just don't see how that could be a real thing at this point what well, if if it's such a big thing why isn't it happening to other athletes so uh, I'm gonna reserve judgment till I hold off and I hear more information and the B sample is tested and uh, investigations is made into finding out what's good with who's been handling the sample could someone be setting him up yada 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 but I'm not saying he's innocent I'm not saying he's guilty. I'm saying I'm saying there's due process. I'm gonna wait to see how some of this shit plays out, and then I'm gonna make my make up my mind from there. But what I do know, it's not good. It's fucking up his career. It, it could be very very bad for him, man. Like it possibly could be it, dude. If they don't have a, a valid reason or anything and he gets four years and he's like suspended four years for steroids, that's it, man. And that hurts the sport because he is the Michael Jordan of the sport. It's like Michael Jordan popped for something, you know, that'd be different. Um, who. I think that there's too many, I I don't even know what to say, because there's just, how, how, how could it happen, you know, so it's either, it's either deliberate adulteration, or he's guilty, that's it, um, that's all I have to say for it now, uh, probably be talking about it a little bit more later, and, um, Yeah, man, you already know. It's Mastermind MMA.